Hey, this is our campsite here at uh, Seaside, uh, the Thousand Trails Park. Very spacious. It was easy to get into. This park has two uh, sides, a north and the south side. We're on the north side here. Uh, it has a 50 amp uh, plug-ins. The campsites also have these little cabins you can rent. And uh, they have bathrooms in them and showers and and propane for the heater and and your uh, barbecue and stuff really nice camp uh, here's a spacious uh, campground uh, with the motorhomes and the trailers uh, this park is spread out really uh, in the woods there and it's only a, like a mile and a half from the seaside town. They have an indoor swimming pool, outdoor uh, sunbathing. Uh, they have a hot tub. They have a dry spa inside. They have adult hours also. Here I came in and I, I wasn't in my bathing suit, so I had to uh, put on these little blue slippers if I wanted to go inside. They have the free coffee in the mornings. They have the table, you, tables and chairs in here. They have the ping pong, as you can see. And they have other games also. But, it's you know, they have the fireplace. In the wintertime, they'll have that going. It's really nice, really, really spacious. Here's those little blue shoes I had to put on. Uh, they don't want you walking in your, you know, shoes in there. So the bathrooms, they need a little bit of work, but typical campground bathrooms you know this is inside the pool they want you to shower first before you go in the hot tub or the pool which ain't a bad idea i guess anyway it needs a little bit of tlc but the park is really nice I, I'm, I'm not gonna complain at all uh, they they had employees around helping you uh quite a bit cleaning up of course they could be trained a little better on their cleanup procedures and the pool inside it's heated uh, the, okay now this is in the uh, game room uh, the clubhouse I guess they call it there's the bathrooms they have the puzzle area they got little games as you go in here you got the re, you know lounge for the TV uh, free coffee also in this one you got pool tables outside here and those barbecues back there are for anybody to use you could come up and have a picnic up here and barbecue your meat it's propane it's all free uh, to use mm -hmm. and then uh, the picnic tables outside you can see that and they have a fire pit over there that is a uh, propane fire pit so that was really cool too they just turned that on at night uh, oh, excuse me. No, this one is not the propane. This one is the uh, fire, which they, they have the firewood there. Playground for the kids. They, they a lot of stuff for the kids to do. This park's really spread out. They got the tennis courts. Um, and you can also uh, get propane for your rig or your trailer or, or your tanks right here. And then right over here is a walk-in tent area. You park out here and you have, that's a tent campground. And I didn't walk through there and film them. I didn't want to. And then here's a little pond. This is a little pond cross from my motorhome. My motorhome's right over there. There it is. And then there's that little creek there. No mosquitoes, believe it or not. That water's not moving. But we set out at nighttime and uh, no mosquitoes at all. A lot of frogs though. Now here's a different part of the campground is uh, like a little culty sack back there it's there in their own little campground i guess you'd say within a campground this is really nice here too they also had the 50 amp hookup here so this is a really nice section of the uh, campground really quiet over there now here is the south side this is the south side they mostly have 30 amp hookups over here they don't have the swimming pool. They don't have as much activities over here for the the kids. Every every time they wanted to go in this pool, they had to 
you know, go out the gate, across the street, into another gate, into the north side. But the campground, again, was clean. Uh, it had a lot of sp spacious, you know, room between the motorhomes. It, it was it was nice. Not as nice as the north, but it, it was okay. I would, uh, I would camp on that side, but, you know, we needed 50 amp. And we could do with 30 amp if they didn't have 50 amp. They had a nice laundry mat here. Uh, two dollars to wash, two dollars to dry. We did a couple loads of laundry, and that was really clean too. Here's an aerial view of my drone shots of the park, and you got the ocean, which is only less than a mile and a half to seaside, and that was a really neat little town, also by the way, really fun to uh, to go to. And there's a campground. It's spread out. You can see in this aerial shot how spread out it is. It is a nice park. I would definitely come back to this park. We uh, spent about a week here. So it was, it was pretty nice. A lot of room. They have uh, storage. Like if you want to store your trailer right over there at the very end over there. Like if you take off somewhere and you're... You don't want to keep it at a campsite. They have the little storage there too. There's the tennis grounds. Uh, there's that little lake, pond, I guess you'd call it. But it was fun. Definitely fun. Here's an aerial shot coming down on my motorhome and our friends. That's right there. You see them walk around. That's Jim and Denise's motorhome. We met them on the way up. Uh, they, they came from Florida down. And and I don't know who that is right there in the middle. I was just coming down on it. There, Jim and Denise putting some stuff away because they're getting ready to take off. And then there's me and my our motorhome. They're out taking a walk with Flash, and I just decided I would just do a drone shot. Anyway, this campground is nice. You'll enjoy going there. Thank you for watching.